You're looking at the view from the top of the new Cooper River Bridge. Roughly 575 feet above the Cooper River, we're over the East Tower on the Mount Pleasant side of the shipping channel. It's a little bumpy because we're hanging from the huge tower crane being used to build this section. When this was taken, the towers were still 85 feet short of completion. It's a view most people will never see unless they hire a helicopter or small plane or they're doing maintenance on the cable suspending the new bridge deck. People ask, what's the view like? In a word, incredible. You can pick out landmarks in every direction. Looking to the west, your view sweeps down East Bay Street toward White Point Gardens and the beginning of the battery. Charleston Harbor lies before you, and on a clear day, you can see for miles. Below you is the Yorktown, the Fighting Lady. It looks almost like a toy boat from up here. The town of Mount Pleasant stretches out towards Sullivan's Island, the Isle of Palms, Awendaw, and McClellanville. Looking up the Wando, we see the port and pristine marshes by the acre. Then Drum Island and Town Creek. And we look toward I-526, North Charleston, and the old Navy base. And while few people will see the view from up here, the view from the deck of the new Cooper River Bridge will be almost as incredible. Located just above the concrete cross beam that connects the tower's legs, here's a quick preview in the same order as before. Beginning with the current Charleston side of the old bridges, down the side of the peninsula following East Bay Street, past White Point Gardens to the harbor, we skip past the tower leg itself and see the shipping channel and the Yorktown. And on to Mount Pleasant. The Wando Terminal. and back to Town Creek, looking toward North Charleston. People undoubtedly will spend much time looking at the new bridge, and they already are. It's already clearly visible completely across Charleston. This view is from the Ashley River Bridge, and this is from well up Coleman Boulevard in Mount Pleasant. But the most exciting thing is that with the walking and biking lane, for the first time, it will be safe to take your camera and your family and see this beautiful part of the low country from the new bridge. <laughs>